Suppose I carry out an experiment to find the resistance of a resistor and I get a value of 490 ohms. This is called my experimental value. I know my value won't be exactly right and so I estimate how far off I think it might be and I write it like this. This is me saying that my best guess at the resistance is 490 ohms, but it could be as low as 460 or as high as 520 ohms. But I'm confident it's within that range. The plus or minus bit is the uncertainty. When written like this with units, it's called the absolute uncertainty as opposed to the percentage uncertainty. Now suppose that the true value of the resistor is 470 ohms. By true value, we mean the value you would get if you measured it with a perfect measuring instrument. So we can never know the true value, but we treat the value given by the manufacturer as the true value, and we also treat accepted values like 9.81 meters per second squared for G as true values as well. If the true value is 470 ohms, that means my value is actually off by 20 ohms. It's 20 ohms too big, and we call this the error of my value. So error is the difference between my experimental value and the true value. And we can say that uncertainty is my estimate of the maximum error of a value. If you're finding these videos useful, please subscribe. And don't forget to check out our resources on the website and follow Learning Dojo on Twitter.